Here comes a turbo shot, Crusher. Too slow, Blaze. My net is unstoppable. Whoa, where did that speed come from? <gasps> that was way faster than your serve, Blaze. Crusher is cheating. That net is using elastic potential energy. Elastic potential energy is the energy stored in something stretchy, like these springs. When the ball hits, the net releases all that stored energy. Team, we need a mechanic and an energy specialist. Gabby and Watts to the rescue. Whoa, this is a crazy high spring constant. It's adding way too much force to Crusher's shots. That high spring constant is why the net is a super spring. It stores tons of energy and gives the ball massive extra speed. We can't stop the net, so we have to control the impulse. Gabby, we need to loosen the string tension of Blaze's racket. Impulse is about force over time. A looser string tension will give the ball more contact time, which lets us absorb the net's crazy kinetic energy. Let's see you try to hit this one, Blaze. It's got a special spin. <laughs> that curve is impossible. Loosening the string tension. Ready to absorb that energy, Blaze? Incoming ball velocity reading, 150 miles per hour. That's a huge kinetic energy. Wow, precision really matters when things move that fast. Looser strings, longer contact time. Time to absorb that impulse. What? <laughs> the net, it ate all his power. Yes, the loose string tension worked. You absorbed his kinetic energy. It's match point. Crusher is gonna give it everything he's got. Cushion the impact. Now, add my force. Take that, Crusher. Panic button. Maximum tension! Get back here, ball! Oh no! The net's pulling the ball down! The elastic potential energy is too much! Downward force reading critical! Watts! Counter the pull with a static lift beam! Quick! Static lift engage! Go, ball, go! Anti-tension lubricant deployed. We've temporarily reduced the spring constant. Now, Blaze, hit it with the calculated force and angle. Last chance. Game, set, and match. No, my cheating net. How did you win? Good game, Blaze! We did it, team! We won with science! We won by understanding energy. We use loose strings to increase the impulse and absorb the kinetic energy. And great job, Watts! That static lift was the perfect counterforce to the net's downward pull. And Gabby's anti-tension lubricant bought us the time we needed by reducing the net spring constant. Awesome teamwork! <laughs> the most thrilling moment was that final energy recoil return. We managed the energy, and we won! Don't worry, Pickle. Next time, my remote-controlled bowling ball will win. Ooh. I like big balls. Not again! I'm stuck! I meant to get stuck! It was a, a mud demonstration. Great job today, Blaze. Thanks, AJ. I wonder how we can use that predictive arc technique for our next big stunt jump. These forward for you. As you can see, the net absorbs the kinetic energy, demonstrating the principles detailed in Act Two. 
We achieved conservation of energy. Our input force plus the net's energy equaled the perfect winning shot. Everything have an elastic limit. The net springs were pushed too far, but our strings were tuned just right. Whoopsie! My energy, snap, is gone! Thanks for helping us manage the energy. See you next time! Yeah! My static electricity created an equal and opposite force. That tiny lift was all the ball needed. This elastic potential energy is the worst! Help! And that's the power of recoil! Remember, by increasing our contact time with the loose strings, we controlled the impulse and successfully changed the ball's momentum. Wow, Blaze! You're a science hero! And you can be one, too! That fast ball from the net had a lot of kinetic energy. We beat the elastic potential energy that was stored in the springs. Oopsie! Did I tie you up, Crusher? That's not helping, Pickle. The final winning shot required a perfect force. It was the sum of our super speed and the energy absorbed from the net. Well, I hope Crusher learned his lesson about cheating with springs. And we learned an awesome lesson about impulse and elastic energy. There you go, Crusher. Now go home and think about impulse. I was thinking about it. I was just resting. Another adventure won with STEM. Let's roll.